Already this month, we've had 11,000 people who have picked up the set of five Cutwork ceramic ornaments with the gift boxes. Now, if these were purchased separately, they'd be closer to $65, but this is QVC and QVC2. So you expect an even better sale price and that we've done that for you. These are $34.15. They are also customer top rated. They come to us from Lightscapes, and Lightscapes is all about the mood, the essence, the romance, the, the fun and magic that is lighting, but now also bringing us wonderful decorative pieces like either the Christmas lanterns, which are the, the squares, you're seeing that right there, or the ornaments, which I have in front of me that are around, and they're beautiful. We have four different options for you. I happen to have the ornaments done in pastels. If you go with the classics, it's going to be more of the traditional Christmas red and green. And then you also have the same option for pastels for the ornament uh, uh, as you do for the lanterns. All that scroll work and cutout work and design is done individually. Each one is battery operated. And by the way, for each one, all you need are two AA batteries. But now you've got five individual gifts where the boxes even have to and from on it to be able to express your gratitude, give thanks, and let someone know that you were thinking about them. Andrea Corbo, I cannot do a show on a Monday without her, and we're, we're gonna talk about Christmas <laughs> up until Christmas. It's good to see you again, how are you? I am great, it is so nice to be here with you, and these ornaments are so very special from Lightscapes, and so many of you love them, because since they're from Lightscapes, they all illuminate from within. With either your choice of warm white light or with just the flip of a switch, you can change that light to color morphing. All five of the ornaments in the set do either light setting. And like you said, they're all a little bit different and they come in different shapes and different colorways. So you have the pastel set in front of you. I have the pastel lantern set in front of me. This one here in my hand goes with the classic round set. And then there's also that plastic lantern, sorry, which is hanging on my tree. So they look beautiful anywhere. They have a flat base, so you could set them tabletop, and they come with the gift boxes. So if you are gifting them, and we gift ornaments every year in our family, right. the boxes are included, so it couldn't be any easier. Uh, the, they're about the size of a softball. They're not tiny. Everything you see color-wise is hand-painted. Every little cutout detail has to be hand fettled as they call it and and they're just charming as charming can be the fact that you give me the boxes too that's nice now those are the classic lanterns that is by far the most popular but don't forget that pastels are popular too that's the classic ornaments in the round there's the pastels for the lanterns and there's the pastel for the round so nicely though we still have all four that are available and the customers have raved about the quality. Andrea, we're used to seeing top rated when we talk about Lightscape cell. That's the norm. That's right. I mean, these are all ceramic construction. They have a six hour timer built in regardless of whether you use the warm white or the color marking light. So customers love them because they're easy. You can hang them on your tree and not have to worry about resetting every day, turning them on and off. It's gonna do that for you. And I wanted to show you a really fun way to use these. If maybe you're not hanging them on the tree, or if you get them right away and your tree's not going up for a few more weeks, you can use them as really fun photo stands. The top oh. of each ornament is a double gold ring. So you could slip a gift card in there, you could slip a place card if you want to set them at the table, or you could put your favorite photos or Christmas cards and display them proudly throughout your house. Maybe one in one room, one in another. It's a set of five, so you can break them up and use them throughout your home, or you can use them all together on a tree or all together on the mantle. Look at how pretty that color morphing light is on the ones that you have on your table. It creates such a beautiful light show. Each icon on each ornament is different, and the colors on each ornament are different as well. Yeah. All hand-painted, they have matching gemstones to match back to that colorway, and those icons are so sweet, so you can, you can kind of pick who's gonna get that cute gingerbread ornament if you're giving it as a gift. Yeah, I'm taking the star. Okay, <laughs> undeservedly so, it. undeservedly so. <laughs> now, I gotta ask you, Andrea, that's a great idea, and I hadn't thought about it. Are you a Christmas card lady? And I'm betting lunch yeah. money that you are. Yes, this is actually one of our family Christmas okay. cards from a yes. few years ago. I, and I love to display the ones that I get from our family and friends. So my, I do these little photo collages. We always put the year on it. 
So it creates a little time capsule for our family and friends. And I save them every year from the people that we receive them. And I love to display them. Sometimes I hang some on the door frames in my room, but I love to put them on the ornaments and kind of create a little photo stand. It's a really fun way and a special way to share those memories throughout my house. You know, there's really, I'm sorry, there's only two types of people on the entire planet. The Christmas card ladies and and those of us that wish we had the time or knew how to manage our time to do it. Every year. I do calendars too, Dan. I'm raising the bar. Do I do photo do this? calendars every year. I know you've got children, you've got a husband, you've got a very successful business. Yes. I, every year, I, I live on a farm. I've got some of the cutest photos in the world. Christmas card, Aww. baby lambs. Okay, I, I've got that. <laughs> and every year I take the photos and somewhere around December 15th, I go, oh, I forgot to do the card again. And I do it every year because I get so busy. Uh, people this year, I think, will appreciate those family newsletters, those family Christmas cards more than ever before. Not that we didn't in the past, but we couldn't gather last year. Andrea, this year we get to see each other face yeah. to face and not just like what we're doing now on Skype. I can't wait to hug my grandbabies I at Thanksgiving. Know. I, I know that's so it's so special to all of us. And if you're hosting Thanksgiving, maybe you give those grandbabies one of these sweet ornaments. Yep. I give ornaments to my nieces and nephews every year. If you're giving uh, if you're having a holiday party and you want to give one away to your guests, I mentioned you could put a place card right here in the top, set it at everybody's spot at the table or just lay them around your, you know, your displays and let people take the one that that speaks to them the most. Because, you know, there'll be somebody that says, I love the snowman or there'll be someone that says, I love the star. Yeah. And each one is a little bit different, but you're getting five. So it's five gifts checked off your list. Maybe it's your teachers. There's a photo of it in my um, in my powder room because I love to use these instead of those ugly plug-in night lights. I agree. I like to put one of these in the powder room so it gives a little bit of light, helps people find the powder room, but it's so pretty and decorative. And they're in my kitchen. I just put them around a plate of cookies, which I know everyone's going to have cookies out for the holidays this year because we're so excited to be sharing the holidays with our friends and family. Let people take one home. Make a little vignette in a corner. There's so many ways to use beautiful ornaments throughout your home. They're not just for trees anymore. Yeah, yeah. In fact, I yeah, think people are going to be great. using them more for tabletop display and added light than, than they will actually hanging them on the tree. But you could. Easily you could. You certainly could. Yeah. And you should. Yeah, they're beautiful. They're, they're easy to hang on the tree. They come with the ribbon. They each weigh about two pounds. The round ones are a little bigger. They're about three and a quarter inches by about four inches tall. The lanterns are just under three inches um, in diameter and then four and a quarter inches tall. But they're so beautiful. They're going to create such a lovely show on your tree or on your mantle or however you choose to use it throughout your home. And again, you get to pick if you want the warm white or the color morphing light. So there's really something for everybody. Uh, and the whole idea with lightscapes, again, it, it, we live in a day and an age where so many things are mass produced and cranked out and, you know, manufactured. The, the artisans create this. You know, it starts with an original mold that's made by hand. Uh, ceramics are done with a liquid form of clay called slip, like, like slipping on ice or a banana peel. It's called slip. But then they have to do all the hand painting work. And anywhere there's an opening, there's usually residue. So they come back with little wooden sticks called fettles and they do all of that workmanship and they then sponge it, they glaze them, they refire them. Uh, it's fun to see artisans being able to create things like this, look at that, that make you happy. Yeah. These would be almost 65 bucks if they were priced the way they normally would be. But because Lightscapes has been a part of our family at QVC for many, many years, they did these five piece sets just for us. So we get them at a better price. That price is $34.15. Think about it. I don't even know who I may gift all five to at this point, but I know that there will be five individuals between now and the holidays that I just simply want to say thank you to. Uh, this year more so than any other. Uh, what, what do you send a cardiologist, Andrea, that, <laughs> that, that <laughs> saved your- are perfect yeah. for yeah. Yeah. yeah, I totally agree. Because what do you send somebody that's really done something special for you, but you don't know their preferences, what kind of food they eat or if they drink wine, but you know that this will be something that whether they're hanging it on a tree or they're displaying it in their office, 
It's something that's going to make them think of you. Go ahead and put the two AA batteries in and write your name at the bottom. Maybe put the year so that they remember you every time they take that out. It's, it's truly a special memento. We, like I said, we gift them every year to my kids' teachers. I love that they come with the gift boxes included. We give them to our nieces and nephews. We've started a tradition where we give them ornaments every year so that when they are grown, they have a whole collection they can start with. So there's so many people that would appreciate just a little something special for the holidays. And five ornaments in a set is five people checked off your list. I get them every year. I get multiple sets, and then I buy one for myself as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because you, yeah, you don't want to be left out either. And I, exactly. I urge you, on the bottom, there's enough marking area with a, a Sharpie pen. Put the year, put 2021, yeah. so that you can remember which year it was. Uh, I've had over 100 of you on the phone lines. I, in no way, shape, or form am I trying to make a joke. This is a true story. My go-to, maybe because I'm not all that creative, my go-to for a gift for years was the classic bottle of wine. And made the mistake, saw friends that I had not seen in a while that during the pandemic uh, had acquired a drinking problem and had just gotten out of rehab. And I show up at their house with a bottle of wine. And I felt like a complete fool. And I was embarrassed, they were very gracious, but that's a mistake I won't make again. So this is just joy and happiness for everybody with no worries. And they're special. Each one is completely different. You know, they're all pretty, but just like, you know, our grandchildren or our family members and even our friends, uh, as lovely as each one is, they are all individuals. They're all different. You get such detail work. By the way, the more openings that you do in ceramics, uh, the tougher it is to make. So your people really didn't make it easy on themselves at all, Andrea, to bring this set to life. No, they really didn't. And they incorporated that cutwork design on the round ornament three times around. So that no matter what yep. direction you're looking at it from, you're going to see either the cute little cut, the cutouts or that scroll work that they did in between with the matching gem. The tops and the bottoms are hand painted. They're so nicely done. They've got that embossed ceramic working as well. And like you said, it's fun. Each one is different. So it's fun to pick if you're gifting them. Who gets the gingerbread man? My, my niece Jacqueline is the baker in our family. She's 13 years old and she's amazing. Nice. So she's going to get that gingerbread cookie ornament this year for sure. I hope she's not watching it. So I just spoiled her gift, but <laughs> it'll be with something else. But it's a little something special that I like to give to each of them. And it's fun to be able to customize for each of their personalities, each of their interests, maybe their favorite color. If you're not sure, do they have a favorite sports team? You know, what color matches yeah. back to maybe their favorite sports team? So many ways to individualize this for the people on your list this year. Well, again, and you're looking at about, about $7 per gift. That's hard to find. It really is difficult to find a gift that can have this much of a sentimental appeal and still keep that price really, really affordable. Uh, I think they're gorgeous. Andrea, you, you, you and I have more to talk about in the program, do we not? Yes, we do. I'll be back. Coming up with Andrea, we have from Mr. Christmas.